Hi everyone, welcome back. For those of you who are new here, my name is Melody and in today's video, we're just gonna be shopping around. I have multiple stores to go to, so I thought in this case, I'd, sh I'd hop on and I'd just say hi and uh, let's get going. It's gonna be a scorcher today. It's 91 degrees right now and it's actually 1056. They seem to think we're gonna hit record-breaking highs today, so let's get going. All right, everyone, first stop is Home Goods. And they've got quite a few Halloween finds. Uh, let's see. Oh, what's this? Little cute mugs. Actually, this is really adorable. This is $5. Look at this, it's two skeletons going down a slide. That is so weird. <laughs> I like it. Got the mermaids here. We've got their witches out. These are $20. Oh, how much are these guys? $12.99. And fourteen ninety nine for the larger one. They've got these books here. Fifteen dollars for that. Check out this wreath. Wow. Forty dollars for that. Look at this witch. Check out those eyelashes. Whoa. They go all the way above her eyebrow. I've made it to some of the fall decor. But the gnomes are still still out and about. $12.99 for him. Happy fall, y'all. With the little wooden nose. 
This pumpkin is pretty. Let's see, how much is that? $20 for this pumpkin. Oh, this is, oh, I like this. This looks like it's some sort of a pottery by Martha Stewart. It is $8. It's actually very nice. I've also got it in this color as well. And a larger version. The larger version is $15. So. $14.99. $15. Some more witches here. Love the dresses. $7.99 for this. Oh my goodness, you guys, look at this. <gasps> $10 for him. And I've also got this little spooky house for $17, $16.99, and it looks like it does light up. How about this little sweet girl here? She is 13 by Bella Lux. She comes in a couple different dresses here with her little fur collar. Oh, check out this witch's hat. This is $30. It's pretty. Does it light up? And it does, it looks like it lights up. There's another witch. Spooky house. $20 for this one. Oh, and look at this lady, spooky night. What are these? Oh, I guess you just hang them on the wall. That's cool. Thirteen dollars for those guys. Oh my goodness, I've never seen one of these in real life. Hi. It's like a fancy Frankenstein. He's twenty-five. How about this pumpkin here? Look at that. It's got the snake with the pink pumpkin and the flowers on it. $13. Pumpkin caramel cupcake mix. Oh, I think I have to try this. It's $5. We've also got these molds. I guess, is it for popsicles or maybe ice cubes? Or you can get the two pack for five. Oh, dead and breakfast, rest in peace, $7.99. Oh my goodness, they have the peanuts. $10 and you get two towels and it's already done. Oh, they've even got the Charlie Brown version. Oh, so cute. Okay, look at this. They've got Snoopy. Oh wow, look at these. It's Thackeray Binks. These are $10. And they've also got a Mickey version. Frequent flyer here. <laughs> That's cute. This is cupcakes and cashmere. Ten dollars, and you get you're getting three towels here.
All right, guys, I am now in Walmart and they've got these fall pillows here for $6.98. Look at these little mushrooms, aren't they adorable? Got them in two colors. They've also got this pumpkin patch pillow and this cute little owl pillow. Along with this pumpkin. and blessed for three twenty eight. This is cute. How much is that? That is forty dollars. Oh, it actually has a hood at the back. That's cute. Got this blouse here by Free Assembly, $22. It's got the button button in the back on the collar. Oh, this is cute. This is $32. Look what I found. Grinch jammies with the little hat and socks. Oh, it's for Christmas, yeah, I guess it is. The Grinch, hello, Melody, $23. And the socks have the little grippers at the bottom. And they've also got these pajamas, look at that. It's got all your monsters there, all the classics that is, the little shorts. Oh, here we go, how much is that? $16.98. Oh, they've even got Mickey. Look at that. Nightmare Before Christmas with the really long socks and the night shirt. How much is that? Where's the tag? Oh, here we go. $18.98. These are so soft. I can't explain to you just how soft they are. Let's see, how much are they? $16.98. Very soft by Joy Spun. It's like a little sleeping pants and top. I'm gonna go to the men's section. I like to look at their t-shirts.
everyone. I am at Sam's now. I actually came to check out this purifier. They've marked it down from, I don't know what it, it was. I think it was like $2.99. They took $100 off. Looks like they've got the Halloween out. Let's see what they've got here. They've got their animated skeletons. Says they're over 5.5 feet tall. It's $160. And it looks like you get both of them. And we've got their dragon here for 190. He's 13.5 feet wide. Wow. And he's got a look. He's got a skull. He's stepping on. Oh my god. He's gonna crush it. That's funny. He means business. Oh, and they've got these little ghosts and jack o' lanterns here. They're five foot tall. What are these? $80 for these. And they've got the animated scarecrow again. For eight, he's uh, eight feet tall. How much is he? I can't tell. The, the, the box is covering the sign. Let me scan it really quick. Okay, this guy is 180. By the way, can we talk about the scan and go option here at Sam's? Isn't that great? I love it. So one thing I hate about Costco because their lines are the worst. Those lines don't go nearly as fast as they say. That's my personal opinion. This is pretty. How much is this? Okay, I just spotted these. What are these? Are these, is this a costume? Oh, this is a costume. Look at this. This is $50. It comes in like this box and you've got Bumblebee. And Optimus as some of the options I see here. I don't see any. I don't see any other options. For hero costumes are twenty-five dollars, and then they have some princess costumes. Those are forty. Wow, these are actually pretty good. <gasps> Look at this! The ceramic candy bowl. You've got the kitty cat. Ooh. And pirate, <laughs> Jack Lantern pirate. That's cool. I like that. That's really neat. It is hand wash only. They've got their members mark active hooded jackets. These are fourteen eighty one, so fifteen dollars. Really nice too. Oh, here's a picture of what it looks like. The free country vests are here. These are nice. The zippers seem pretty good. You've got a zipper pocket up here. So you've got three zipper pockets. One, two, and three. This is the men's. And I see it in black. This hunter green. And then this kind of brownish tannish color. Here's the woman's version. It's got the two pockets, but no pocket up here. Oh, it does have an inside pocket, but it's not zipped. Oh, two, two inside pockets here. We've also got this Gap field jacket. This is $27. They've got it in navy, this cream, you know, cream color, and then army green, which this is my favorite right here. Got these boxy jackets for 17. Okay, I want to share with you guys these hoodies. I have one from a few years ago. They're $17. And you guys, these are really nice. They're, it's in the men's section and they're nice and thick. And they're soft. I'm telling you, they're super cuddly. Like in the fall and winter, like this and some leggings and I'm just so happy. It's like you're cocooned in coziness. 
and it's held up pretty well. Although I do actually line dry mine because I love it so much. I want it to last. I don't really like the designs they have this year. Otherwise, I'd probably grab another one. I like it so much. But yeah, for $17, it's not bad. Look at this. Spooky vibes. This is $17. Look at the little leggings. That goes so cute with the pink tool. Future leader. And then you've got the little heart with the star and the rainbow and the pretty foil stars with the striped leggings. It's navy and white striped leggings. Oh, here's a Hello Pumpkin. This is cute. I think this is my favorite. I love the pink and the black together. Well, everyone, I'm back from running my errands and I thought I'd show you my haul here of what I've got. And I have a small story to tell you. On my way out of the car to, to get, <laughs> how am I gonna word this? On my way, uh, on my way out of the car, I was walking to the back to get the stuff out, and I guess I had parked too close to the grass. So as I got to the very edge of the site where the sidewalk starts, I stepped partway on the grass and partly on the sidewalk or the cement. And I fell, <laughs> like it, it caused me to twist my ankle and I just went crash. And to make things even worse, there was a man who was working on the yard down the, down the street, saw me <laughs> and um, actually I was a little embarrassed. Well, more than a little embarrassed. I mean, I was really embarrassed, but I did think it was really kind of him to actually like are you okay do you need help and i i got up and i gave him two thumbs up and i was like i'm okay i mean you can't really tell i did scrape myself a little bit and on my leg i don't know a little bit on my leg but uh other than that i'm okay and I, fortunately i didn't um break anything i was able to get up right away and uh not some bears <gasps> Oh no, okay, just remember, the worst part about it, my cup is okay, but I'm so disappointed. Do you see that? It got scraped up. I'm like, oh man. I mean, it's okay, but what a bummer. I was just, I really do like this cup a lot because it's pretty and it works so good. All right, I've rambled on enough about that. Let me go ahead and show you what I got. First, I want to start with Walmart. I just grabbed two t-shirts in the men's section. I grabbed this for my husband. Spider-Man is his favorite superhero. I'm telling you guys, he knows what version of Spider-Man this is. I, I couldn't tell you, but he happened to know. And then I grabbed this shirt for me. It's a Hello Kitty shirt. <coughs> Excuse me. Hello Kitty shirt. I grabbed mine in the 2XL because I have very wide hips and these do shrink. They're 100% cotton. These were both $8.96. Okay. Oh, I did come home to find my FabFitFun, which I, I guess I can show you that later if you guys want. All right. First off at Home Goods, this is all I picked up. I picked up the pumpkin caramel cupcake mix. It was $5. Not exactly cheap, but it is vegan, soy free, dairy free gluten-free and it says no artificial color so let's hope it tastes good <laughs> you never know it's all, it's all those preservatives that make everything taste great right at dollar tree they had this guacamole seasoning mix i thought i'd give that a try i picked up some more of my street taco seasoning i, I grabbed two and then I found these, Original Roasted Potato Seasoning Mix. I decided to grab two, because I do love to cut up some potatoes and throw them into the air fryer. And I know this isn't the best buy, but I did buy this at Dollar Tree. I got the cream cheese. I bought this thinking of this. This would be good with this. <laughs> How many times can I say this, right? So, and I don't need a lot of icing, so I figured, whoops, I figured this would be good. And then I picked up these Halloween sprinkles from Dollar Tree as well. Again, with this in mind, I thought that'd be kind of a fun treat for myself one day. Let's see, my poor cup. Do you see? It's all scratched up. You may not see. That's okay. 
Oh my goodness, it's so banged up. That's okay. All right, next at Aldi, I grabbed, what else did I grab at Aldi? I picked this up. It's an electric body brush. Now, I think it was regular $15, but I got it for $7 in, was it $7.49? All right, now at Sam's, I picked up this Welly Heroic Bandage Kit. I had been looking for this for a while and wasn't able to find it, and I actually stumbled upon it in my store. Then I grabbed this Joint Health. I really like this stuff. I got the Sam's version. It's like a ultra triple, oh, it says ultra triple joint action, along with this Vital Proteins. Now, along with this Vital Proteins, now they actually had this on sale for $7 off. I think I paid around $25 for it. I also picked up this five pack of Secret Deodorant. This was eight something, so it was just under $9. And I felt like for five, that was a good deal. And let me tell you, as hot as, as it is, I am going through the deodorant. Let's see. Oh, here's the date. So it expires May 2025. I also grabbed these Italian ices. My husband really likes these. And I got the last two boxes. I picked up two of them. They were around $12. Also from Sam's, I grabbed these bagels. We like to have bagel sandwiches. And then I picked up another bag of my Southwest chopped salad. It's like the whole kit. It has the little crispies that go on top and also the dressing. Oh, and a little bag of cheese. I grabbed this charcuterie tasting board. We love these. These are, these are kind of like a fun little thing that we'll like to buy. And actually, my husband really loves the meats. <laughs> and I also picked up this two pack of mashed potatoes. I'll keep one in our fridge and then the other one will go in the deep freeze. They usually reheat pretty well. I forgot to show you, from Aldi also, I picked up whipped cream cheese and I picked up some of this marinated butterfly shrimp. I bought some that was uh, a sweet chili butterfly shrimp and that was really good. So I thought I'd try this here. And this was actually under $7, just under $7. And you get, you get quite a few in there. I thought it'd be kind of fun to open this up and show you what's inside. I actually like that it's got the bigger case, which is what I, I've been wanting. And these are so great. I mean, you know, you can reuse them and whatnot, but I like to keep one in each car. You know, I have the smaller ones in the car. It has a hinged lid, which is really nice. And then on the top tray, you've got these extra large bandages. Love these colors. Oh, look at that. And you might be wondering, Melody, why do you need all these band-aids? Well, I'm a bit accident prone, as you've just heard, <laughs> hearing about me falling. It's really no joke. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at this. It's got a little squid. That's cute. Oh my goodness. I don't mind wearing that. Okay. So it's got a ton of bandages. This is great. And then at the top of the lid, it'll show you like what is where, the large waterproof, medium waterproof, small fabric, bravery badges. And then you've got the knuckle handy, extra long fingertips. I like this, this is really nice. I also forgot to show you guys this. I went to my, one of my favorite stores actually. I love this store, Tesso Life. And as you can see, when I fell, I took my, my bag with me because I was holding it and I squished my box. I got another pack of, oops. I have an electric one, but these are really great for travel. Or sometimes like, let me just tell you, if you're at work and you have a headache, I'll just put this over my ears and put it on my forehead. I look like an, I look really silly, but man, it, it seems to help. So it came with, it's a pack of 12. Please ignore the fact that it's squished by my big body when I fell outside. All right. I picked up one of these. Um, it's like a foot, a foot thingy. It's basically a foot mask and apparently it makes your skin come off. This was, was this $1.99 or $2.99? Let me see my receipt. Oh. oh, okay, nope, I'm totally wrong. 
This was $6.99. That's a lot of money, but oh well. Gidget, no, no. I picked up two of these ginseng. Um, you put them on the bottom of your feet. It's like a detox and I don't know. I just thought that'd be kind of fun to try. I had done some research online and I felt like the ginseng version was the one I wanted. These were $1.99 each. This pack of 12 eye masks was $12.99. And then when I checked out, they gave me this reusable bag, which is really nice. Oh no, see, I, oh, I didn't realize that. Look, that's when I, when I fell, I must have fallen right on the bag. I fell on the concrete. That's why it's so banged up. Well, that's disappointing. Oh, well, that's okay. I can tape that up. All right, let's show you. Let me get my little potion bowl out of the way. Someone's found the bag. Careful, Gidget. Honey, be careful. Hello, be careful. You're gonna fall, honey. You're gonna fall. Gidget, you're gonna fall. Just stay out of the bag, okay? Thank you. Thank you, sweet girl. Get down. Let's get down. Let's be good today, okay? All right, here's my Fab Fit Fun. I'm not sure. Let's see, they got another one of these game things. I mean, does anyone use these? I do not. Oh, looks like I. Looks like I got a free sample of the caramel flavor Ricola throat balms. Hmm. You get six of them. That's nice. Does anyone else remember the day? Back in the day, FabFitFun was like the best. Like around Christmas, you would get all these free samples in your box. Okay, it looks, let me, let me set you guys down. So you can choose some of your items. And I chose this brush. I think I chose it. I can't remember now got kind of a pretty pearlescent kind of tortoisey shelly look I don't know by living proof it's got the soft bristles I also selected this plump plump hyaluronic serum we'll see the, the bottles pretty anyways oh does that look like a peach probably like a peach right I also selected this murad Ultimate Moisture Intense Hydrodynamic Cream or whatever this is. Let's see. So, it has a bit of a fragrance to it. I don't like that, but that's okay. It's kind of the risk I take when I do the Fat Pit Fun. Balance Me Wonder Eye Cream because Lord knows I need it. The bags under my eyes. And then I got this, what's this? Custom Enhancer Palette. I did not pick this. This is not something I would have picked for myself. <laughs> Since I do not wear a lot of makeup, what the? Okay, so it looks like, I don't know what this is. Okay, they're enhancer shades. So I guess if I want to enhance something, oh, and it's got a little mirror, so that's nice. I may find someone to give this to. Oh, and one more thing, what's this, botanical? Oh, okay, and then I got this botany something. And I got this hand and body wash, self-care sandalwood and sage. And that's that. I think I picked these three, or no, these four, and then these, and then these two here, this one and this one, were just sent to me. I decided to open this up so I could show you. It's actually pretty neat. It's got this silicone brush, and then you've got this one here with the pumice, pumice stone, and then you've also got this little, the soft brush here, the very soft bristles, along with the little loofah thing in your recharging cord. They've also got this little suction hook that you can hang in the, uh, on the, the wall of the shower. To charge it, you just pop off the end here. 
So the one downside for me I see right off is the fact that you can't buy replacements of these. Well, you know, I've been thinking <laughs> after seeing this bag being torn like this, I'm thinking that that's probably why my arm really doesn't look like anything happened to it because I had this on my left arm and I fell kind of like forward and on it. So now that I'm thinking of it, the bag definitely saved me. So I'm okay if I have to sacrifice the bag. However, I think if I put some duct tape on the inside and then the outside, it just won't look very pretty. Well, everyone, that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for shopping with me. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you enjoyed the haul at the end. If you do enjoy this type of content, please consider subscribing. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.